Hey, what's up, YouTube? Fans of Neverwinter, we're going to take a look at something called Mastercrafting. Enyo suggested I make a video about that. There wasn't a whole lot out there about that. So I'm going to go ahead and get started here. I'm in a stronghold. Um, unfortunately, you need to be in a guild with a level 12. What you do, you come over, you have your T's in here. And what happens is you can get uh, additional crafting done to your masterwork professions. So you can create other items over and above some of the items you can already create at level 25 in your professions. So, you talk to this little dude. He suggests you go over and talk to the master of coin. So we'll go see what the master of coin has to say here. This is all brand new to me. I haven't done this yet. So we can kind of explore this one together. So look. Hmm. Now I'm going to check this out. Okay. <laughs> so speak to the artisans. Master of coins behalf. Okay, that's easy enough. All right, I guess we're on our way, guys. Another reason to join a guild. Let's get started on this. The woman is relentless. I'll tell you exactly what I told <laughs> the Harvey. I'm not who she thinks I am. I'm just an old man with a toolbox. Now, if you'll excuse me, I offered to help the builder with some fence repairs. Okay. Alright, let's move this along. Okay, we talked to him. Let's check out the Master of Coin. See what happens now. Alright, so now what? Alright, let's go back to the artesian. <laughs> well, this is easy so far. Uh, let's see. Aha, here we go. So, we can start with chemical tailoring. Or jewel crafting. I think with this guy, hmm. I know I have this open all the way to 25. Oh, wow. Okay. Alright, well. Huh. Orange and purple vitriol. Good lord, that's a lot. It'll take a while to get. Well, maybe I can speed this up. Okay, can I get these in the stronghold, maybe? Can I buy them? Let's check it out. Okay, I didn't think they were here. How about you? Nope. I have purple potions, but not the right stuff. All right, so maybe I'm gonna have a clear path here. Maybe I have to create them. All right, maybe we'll go to the auction house. Orange vitriol. Let's see if we can buy them. Okay, so it looks like I can buy these things. Wow, that's expensive. <laughs> maybe I should try another profession. I could, I should just buy it outright, I guess, huh? I wonder how much of the purple is. Maybe I should switch characters. I have another character that I do alchemy with, primarily. I've been divided up. It's not much better, is it? Oh yeah, it's a lot better. What am I talking about? Wow, okay. Well, that might not be too bad, then. You know what, I think I want to switch to my other dude. I don't even know if he's a member of my guild yet. I'll have to check that out. Give me a sec. Okay, I got my alchemy guy. Now let's try this again. 
All right, I guess I'll spring for this. Let's get a move on. 100,000, out. And what, I also need purple. Let's grab some purple. Like I said, I have no idea what's about to happen here, so we get to experience this together. A little bit of teamwork here. Sure, why not? 200. All right, so now what? Got my handy mailbox. Oops. A little bit too close. No, I don't want to. There we go. Okay. Spend those astral diamonds. Oh, yeah. Isn't that long? All right. All right, so we have it, boss. What's up? Back already? Yes, back already. Now oh, this is how the pros do it. We just buy our way. Next task. So now what? Okay, so I need to deliver flasks superior facts of potency and interior okay so are these things just laying around or do I have to buy these things maybe I make them all right let's check it out maybe I make them Okay, superior flasks of potency right here. Okay. I just have to make three of these, which I can do. And superior flasks of protection. Okay, so that's all that is. Just looking to see what else we got. Alright, well, alright, let's do that. Let's see if it's cheaper to buy these. Maybe we can buy these. Superior flask of protection. Let's check it out. Oops. Oh, those are kind of expensive, aren't they? Hmm. What do they do? Okay, I guess I could see why that would be kind of handy. I don't know, do we want to wait though? So we have to wait two hours. Man. I'm kind of cheap though. Alright, we'll just make the darn thing. Wait, I need three of those. Holy crap. I don't know. I hope I get something good for this. What do you guys think? Think that's worth it? Let's see how much the green are. How about Fear of Flask of Potency? Man, those are expensive too. Holy crap. This poor guy's going to be broke. But I'm really curious to see what happens. I have a show to put on. So I must feel like I should do this. You know what? We'll do this in stages. I don't want to burn through all my AD. We'll just do it this way. <laughs> oh, yeah. Of course, these things aren't cheap either. Elemental aggregate. See how much those are going for right now, too. Just shoot myself in the foot there. Yeah, okay. I guess... I guess we'll do it this way. Go the long... It's slow. I was tempted just to grab it. But uh, I'll have to do this in stages, I guess. What the heck, right? I'll go ahead and buy seven of these stupid things. We'll still be better off. Alright, so you, there you have it. We'll finish these up. We'll be back to see what happens. I promise you'll get to see. Okay, guys. Made the potions. Time to pick these up. I 
I hope whatever I'm getting next is worth it. So I'm just forking over a lot of Astro Diamonds worth of crap to this guy. Alright, I guess he wants these. By the way, I uh, don't think I pointed out that I could not have made those potions before he gave me the first recipe. So, Alright, it's complete. Let's fork it over. They are high quality, and I just hope it's worth it. Because <laughs> that's costing a lot. So, let's see. Alright, I'll get a new recipe, see what it is. Alchemical extravaganza. Huh. Oh, that's cool. In order for vitriol. And Alpha Fortis. Okay, it looks like we might have to do a little working for this. So this continues. So this is kind of interesting. Get more and more of this stuff. So I have none of this stuff. Oil of vitriol. I have a feeling this stuff isn't cheap either. Let's see, did he take my stuff? He did. So I just gave him another buttload of uh, value in potions. Hmm. Let's see what I got for it. Oh, that's interesting. See, these are the two that I did not have before. So now I have this. And this. And this. And this. And this. Okay. I had none of this stuff before. So that's pretty cool. I guess this is probably worth it. So we'll continue on this little journey. So what do I need? I need the oil of vitriol. So, okay, so I can make that, so that's cool. Need six of those. Wow, that's going to take a while. All right, we'll get started. That's been enough on, on this guy, so I guess I'll just continue to make this stuff. And another masterwork tool. I guess maybe I can buy those. We'll check it out. Okay, so the oil of vitriol goes for about 10000 a piece right now. So that's on the pricey side. Let's check out this stuff. Holy crap, that stuff is expensive. Alright, so about 70000 a piece. Alright, man, we got to fork this over. Holy smokes. Okay, we'll go for it. Guys, we're continuing on our professions adventure for the Master Crafting Alchemy. Now, in full disclosure here, to get the oil of vitriol, I tried this, I tried to create this about seven different times and I got zero results. Uh, let me show you something here real quick. Um, you can increase the chance of getting it these if you put your epic level crafting equipment in these asset slots, but unfortunately it only gives you a 20% chance and as we know sometimes in Neverwinter the 20% chance does not necessarily mean a real 20% chance. Uh, seven. I might have even done it eight times, um, but I did not get any yet so I cheated and went to the auction house and bought the five, actually bought six, uh, I bought what I needed for, to complete the quest portion. However, now I also need some of this aqua forte stuff. Now if you go here, since I bought some, I can create my own. I have these other items. I have the nitro, I have the alum. So now I can either make it or I can buy it. Uh, I'm not going to buy it because it's very expensive. In fact, before I started recording, I went and looked. I thought, oh, I'll just wrap it up. Um, I don't mind throwing around some astral diamonds for the videos now and then for you guys, but I do do a lot of grinding and I don't cheat, so, um, and there are other ways to make Astro Diamonds, 
but as you can see to buy these there are 75,000 of these so I'm not uh, going to do that I'm going to go ahead and create these so I just thought that was sort of funny and uh, I wanted to make sure I shared that with you so now I'm on my way um, another thing you can do you can do something to increase your chances if you don't already know this uh, even higher than this you can go to an epic or legendary item I go in here take that out of there and go let's say I want a uh, you know what? You can get a four chamber of Gondor if you're lucky enough to get one in an equipment pack or one of these. Now hold your breath. <laughs> so that's a lot of Astro Diamonds, and I'm not going to do that just to make a video, not at the moment. Uh, I'm certainly not going to break out the credit card as I've never done that before. And it's. Um, out of my reach at the moment so I'm not going to buy these they do give you a 50% chance to make your items as opposed to a 40% chance so it does help increase the odds and it would be worth it if you happen to have one uh, or lucky enough to have one or the four chamber of Gondor also counts uh, you might have gotten one of those at some of the events and it may be bound to your account so uh, feel your you should feel fortunate for having those I know I would if I had one, especially now that uh, I'm working through this master crafting. So anyway, I'll con continue on this process and I'll be back as I complete these. So there you have it. We're started and I'll see you again soon. Now as we continue on preparing for the 2XRP PC event in April of 2017, another way to continue getting our Astral Diamonds is to do the skirmish. You can again do this at different levels, but it is worth doing. To show you here real quick, you can earn up to 10,800 astral diamonds per day doing this as well, just like the dungeons. No, oh, that sounded nice. You'll be able to see I'll add to this total after my dungeon runs for the day. Now the reason this number is higher than the 10,800 again is because of this. I have carryover points from invocations and they add on to that total so it actually goes above that. And I also get a bonus for VIP for dungeon runs and skirmishes. So that's going to inflate my amount just a little bit just so you're aware of that. I like to disclose these things so you know why your totals might not be quite where mine are at. But uh, I'm just showing you how to get some Astro Diamonds. So there, you have all the information. In fact, I'll show you that here real quick. Shouldn't really be doing this in a skirmish. But, uh... Oops. See, even at level 1, you get the 15% bonus on dungeon runs, PvP, and skirmishes. And time for a treasure from that one, and I get almost 3,000 Astro Diamonds to add to our total. And I'll continue on. I like this one, it's fairly quick. Speed is good when you're farming. And again.
All right, full disclosure time. I decided to go ahead and buy the Aqua. So, here we go. We'll go ahead and pick this up. The Aqua Forte. So I spent another 375,000 Astro Diamonds for your viewing pleasure. I got impatient. I decided to hack with it. I'll just do it. All right, now we should have enough to be able to finish this up. Let's see, I've got five or six. I need one more. I need six or six. That, uh, as you probably noticed, I did not uh, throw my epic assets in there whenever I started that. So that's not going to come up no matter what I do. I didn't get it down to tier three. I was talking and not paying attention. So we'll go ahead and buy the other components that we need. Buy one more of these. Ouch. <sighs> I hope you guys like this. <laughs> And, oh, that makes me sweat. All right, so, oil of vitriol. I need one more of those. To be about 10,000. Does something crazy happen? All right, 10.5. Sure, why not? For a penny and for a pound. Okay, now we have all the components we need. It's been a very expensive process. Okay, so they give us another task. Aqua Regia. Alright, let's see what that's about. See what else that opened up, too. Ooh, Dragon's Blood. I think that was already there, though, wasn't it? Yeah. Gilded Ledger. Huh. So I don't even want to begin to guess how much this stuff is worth. Let's check it out. I'm sweating here, guys. You know this is going to be bad. Oh, wait a second. I have this stuff. Are you sure? This can't be right. Alright, well, heck. I make this stuff now. I didn't recognize it. Alright, well, let's pick it up. Okay, I have a bad feeling about this. It's saying Aqua Regia. I'm willing to bet it wants this concentrated crap. Let's see how much that is. Gulp. Wow, they went six of those. My God. Are they insane? Holy cow. Now that's some sweet stuff. I wonder what I get for that once I turn that in. Wow. So can I even make this? Yeah, I guess I can make this right now. Holy cow. All right, guys. Well, there you have it. I'm going to take, do this as a multi-step video. <laughs> it's gotten so expensive. I'm sure you won't mind. At least you got to look at part of it. I'll continue on as uh, I pick up some of the other items for this. Hope you appreciate that, guys. Uh, I just want to recap that, though. It is extremely expensive to level these up uh, as you get into master crafting. Looks like you can make a lot with it. Uh, you really probably need those legendary items though in order to make it worth worth doing because uh, just using epic just uh, the percentage isn't high enough I think you'll end up burning through a lot more resources now than what it's worth but uh, that's just a guess I'll keep playing with it and see what I come up with but uh, at least get that gives you a look at it so to recap that a little bit it looks like you'll be into about a million astral diamonds when it's all said and done to get this thing leveled up uh, to the final step there and you, the good thing is you can do it with other professions too so that's kind of a neat thing but it is very expensive and i don't know i don't know we'll, we'll see like i said i'll keep playing with it but i don't know that it's worth it without having those uh, the uh, legendary level crafting tools 
And you also, again to recap, must have a level 12 guild in order to start this. Otherwise, you're out of luck. If you really want to leave the guild you're in and join one, it has a level 12 guild. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's not really a good enough reason. If you're happy with your guild, stay there. And anyway, hope you enjoyed that, guys. Cost me an arm and a leg, but you got to take a look at that. Uh, it's my first time exploring this, too. Looks like it could be profitable, though, if you have the right equipment. Pretty cool stuff. So, thanks for watching, guys. If you have any videos you have up, feel free to leave a message about it, and we'll take a look. I have a real supportive audience here, and I'm sure some of them will be happy to come take a look at some of your stuff, too. So, if you have any comments, please leave a comment. And thanks for watching.